second now under 40 seconds as they wrap around quad towards the bomb side but there's three people holding the site right now the bomb part they fake it once there it's twisted nitro look at the cleanup not even anywhere close to an entry yeah i'm not sure what the plan there was just jumping into the bomb site inside your own smoke tapping the bomb but not actually committing to the plant but the bomb carrier was the only person actually attacking the bomb site the rest of the players were just kind of still laid back in the choke point just waiting biding their time and there's not a really a whole lot of things you can see sub rosa boosted up maybe just to try and cover the plant see if he can pick someone off reacting to that bob tap that might have been what that was designed to do. Maybe a, a clever tactic that just didn't work out. We'll take him down a little bit of damage onto automatic there. And even just the, the info, that's great for Nitro just knowing that. Molotov to set up in the corner and then the challenge on top. And Mixwell alone in a one versus two here. The bomb again tipped quite low. A beautiful headshot here for the Spanish player. And he's going to close out the round. And Cloud9 finally picking up a second one. That was beautiful. And that was a three on five that they recover from. Now, the problem is that's not a winning formula, having Mixwell win a, win a round like that in that no, fashion. Definitely not. Maybe it's a dare. Maybe someone stared them to do that. Mixwell will get an early kill, but the response is great for Team Liquid. Two people challenge him right away. The flank from Kusta. He's going to have to walk a little bit because otherwise he's give the whole game away. And they're so quick, Liquid. This, this is a great play from Cooster, and even the opening, I think, from Mixwell was, should have been just fine, but Liquid, they're on top of everything here. Sneaking in, nice headshot. What a follow-up as well, and Cooster, can he actually finish up the round? Twist will take one down, and now Automatic, he's out in the open, and that double team is going to bring him down. That's an ace for Twist. Oh, God. He was absolutely dominant. He's 17 and 2. <laughs> he is. And Naf is 17 and 4. And Stewie's 17 and 8. And, and even Stewie in the chat right now asking if Kusta flank because that's got to be. You have to. That, that's so heartbreaking for Kusta. What an incredible round that, that he just had on that flank. When you have a flank that's that quick and you're in such a good position and all your teammates. Well, at the moment aggression from the CT side. We saw it in the first game as well. A peak like that, but with a flashbang, but the flashbang is maybe a little misplaced or not as effective as they thought. And now the Krieg just goes to work. Stewie gonna march his way into the B-bomb site and Liquid. Now they know the site is so clear. No need to even clear the corners. You have three frags, Daps and Mixwell, both defenders of the A-bomb site. And there will be no saving. This will be a commit to the retake for Cloud9 and likely a 16 to 4 victory for Team Liquid. Yeah, for Cloud9 this round was uh, the very opposite of what they needed and they don't have any more space to work with. So mix well in them one versus four to try and do something and that's going to be Stewie one more time in the race in the round here. That's going to be I just I can't believe it. That was this is 